more. And here's Conan waiting for the start of the hash run, wagging his tail. With Jenny. Seeing American Pie along with the two glasses of water in and food. Here we have the uh, Sunday hash. 28th of, 28th of August, 1988. Motley crew, all set to go. And this is the beautiful vista of Sheko Car Park. And there's all the car parking spaces which you're not allowed to use because the buses have to turn around in them. So we've got a real parking problem. But never mind, we'll soon be up running along those beautiful hills there. Hey, good day, Bruce. Would you care to say a few words for the uh, viewers? So I can't, we can't hear the sound, we're lip read, it's all right. This is going out to the Deaf and Dumb Society, so they'll be able to tell what you say. Peace. G E T. Hello, Sharon. How are you doing? Are you running today? Are you? Here's the rest of the crowd. And there's a, a rare view of Mark sober. I hope so. I hope so. Oh, I missed that. Yeah. There's a GM warming up. And there's Cora with a short haircut. And Lily. There's Conan raring to go. Some of the new arrivals. Conan can't wait. Now here's the hash in Sheko village. I just come off the beach. And there's a few more still coming. Maybe not, that's it. So here we go again to catch them all up. And here the hash comes out onto this little beach here. St. Stephen's Beach, what do you mean? St. Stephen's Beach. I don't know what it's called, but uh, all sorts of going on here. And there they go. I'd better hurry up and catch them. Local championship. I don't know what it is. And there's Bruce, being beaten by a dog, and now he's just overtaking the dog. And here we see one of the fine Sheko residences. And the pack disappearing in the distance towards it. Once again, I've got to get off my horse and get after them. And I have to look back as we go up the steps and take rather a pleasant shot of this beach, which is part of Sheko, but not the main one. Very pleasant. The hills in the background. There's the Sheko Golf Club here. Some of the chaps just going back for a cold beer, I imagine. A rather a pleasant spot. And as you can see, quite a nice golf course. And there's two of the pack just going by. So once again, unfortunately, I have to go. That way, Jenny. Now Jenny trying to find out the right way for the trail. Thought that she'd follow me. And I think there's one or two still to come out of this jungle. Somewhere. Maybe they're not. Hold on! And it's Anne. 
On right. On right, Fidey. On right. Don't you know the on difference? Right. Come on. Well, we're now back at the beer. It was a nice short run, about half an hour. Quite enough for the day like this. Over here. And one more. I think she enjoyed it, I'm not quite sure. That's the first. That's the first. She made it, she said. <laughs> oh, I keep coming in in trips of rubs. Lungs bursting. <laughs> streaking for the finish. <laughs> so, what did you think of that? <laughs> That's a beautiful view of the back of your head, Mima. Mind, it's a definite improvement on the front. <laughs> There's Conan back from the run. He didn't think very much of it. He collapsed halfway round. Now to be put under attack to revive him. He said, I don't even like the beer. Anyway, here's the chaps. We don't like the beer. Well, I've noticed that, yeah. Orange coloured beer, though. Very strong. 10% alcohol. Oh, I thought I heard Jenny's voice there. The rescuer of Conan. Hey, Paul. And out on the beach is everybody having a good time. <laughs> Charles Atlas. <laughs> and the girls over there. Successfully uh, finished their first run, some of them. And it's a, uh, a nudist section of the hash. Highly intelligent conversation. And here we are with the uh, hash just arriving at the restaurant, and Bruce is just passing by and admiring the meal. I told you before, fuck off. Here's, here's the meal. Oh, he's buggered off, looks like chicken again. Anyway, this is the restaurant, and uh, here's the hash in here. And uh, in true outside broadcast style, we shall go in. Oops, I just went down a step. Nurse Conan, who's looking very worried because he thinks he's going to get cooked. And here's, and here's Bruce. Getting his bike in it. And here's the man who, in about four hours' time, will be controlling the airspace of Hong Kong between Singapore, China, and the Philippines. And there's somebody just died and they're carrying him out. He's got his parachute. <laughs> Thank you. 
<laughs> yes, an intellectual conversation. He's totally, totally pissed off, this pigeon. Uh, 